all right ladies and gentlemen so i should have put out a summon video earlier today we ended up pulling asnot and since we don't actually have like multiplayer it co-op it or any uh epic raids for as right now it'll be dropping in about two days time i'll be doing that then this is just my initial reaction to him so there you go so it's gonna be just my first gameplay of him in the single player it if we go to iz and then we go back to it and i'm also live so i might be commenting with the chat but hope you guys enjoy let me know down below did you guys end up summoning uh i honestly really like the asthma he feels pretty good uh, just a bit just missing a few things his sa2 should have had a debuff on it either make it not a shield or give the shield a debuff mechanic since he needs to proc his sp boost otherwise his damage just feels incredibly lackluster and then he uh should get a higher chance to increase to proc his status on a chance even with the frenzy plus two i don't think it is enough since he doesn't have a vortex so I think he should have gotten the extra increased chance to proc a status element against at least heart attribute enemies and then he would do exceptionally well and maybe his strong attack kit could have been a bit better but i'm not going to touch on that i don't like the same exact strong attacks for each character i do agree uh, but either way enjoy the gameplay let me know about what you guys think and hope you guys have an amazing day and best of luck if you guys consider summoning all right first time trying asnoth uh I mean, I guess I just tried him in the scroll quest, but that was with a bunch of dodging enemies. So we're going to be trying him in the single player IT. This is just a first time reaction. And then we'll try him out when the actual like IT and epic raid and whatnot comes, which I don't know if that's tomorrow or what it is, but we'll be trying it out. All right, so let's go with his SA2. Does not one shot. Okay. There we go. Finally got the SP boost. As soon as I'm out of strong attacks, love that. <laughs> Maybe I should SA one first. Yeah, probably not doing the SA two first, huh? That probably would have been the best play since he can't inflict status elements with it. And you were seeing a very bad gameplay because I'm bad at the game. Let's go. Him with the SA three, SA one. There we go. What is that? Twenty nine hundred each little like hit. Um, and he's no affiliation killer, so do keep in mind he doesn't even have killer. So for one out of five, not bad. Uh, we ended up pulling Asnot in three steps, and then we pulled basically nothing on our ult in the four steps. I went four steps. I got baited. They bullied me to do it. Oh, hello. <laughs> I didn't see him. What's a good transcendent slot for white? I have his first slot for SP. Uh, for his second slot, uh, should be focus. Every SP character is usually SP and then focus for their uh, transcender here. Line it up the attack. Boom. Okay, there's more waves. I don't think I've ever not autoed this, so I don't remember what spawns here. All right, let's see that cool soul bomb. Bro, oh, it looks so cool. This right here looks sick. Yeah. Oh my god, a one shot. All right, we're in the IZ. Let's just go in right here. SA3, boom. Wow, he looks so scary. He looks so spooky. Yet again, he just, he doesn't proc his status on a chance enough, which is super annoying. Four strong attacks, no... Five strong attacks. Obviously, yes, I know the shield doesn't count, but still. Bro, I haven't proc my SP boost one time. There we go. It took six strong attacks to proc my SP boost one time. That's just my biggest disappointment on these characters. If they don't have an increased chance, it's like, mm, I don't know. Oh, wait. Yeah. Can I just one shot? Probably, because I'm really good at the game. Let's go. But yeah, that, that, that's my, like, diggest. <laughs> diggest. My biggest disappointment on these characters is just should have had a higher chance to proc i know he has the frenzy plus two but that's it he, he doesn't have i think uh the seventh anniversary ichigo has an innervator uh some characters have increased chance against heart characters you know something you know he's good it's just that if you don't proc the sp boost it's like mm. all right final run uh I don't know why I pop off for the SA2 first. That makes no sense. I can't proc my status on it. Still no SP boost. There we go. The laser guy. Got to run away. I got insane range. We got Havoc plus 50%. There we go. Oh, I saw that little like Reishi looking bomb at the end of that SA2. That looks sick. Right here, SA1. Unless that was my nav swing. Maybe that was my nav swing. I, I already can't tell. Yeah, once he gets his SP boost, he slaps. 
that was SP boost? It's like, yeah. I just wish he had a higher chance to proc it. You know what I mean? Oh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Run! They keep blending in with the ice. That SA1 unironically actually hits pretty good, but it's just a bit thin. So you do have to line it up a bit well. Damn, did not kill. Pop, 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 pop. Back up. SA1. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, other than the uh, not just not being able to proc an SP boost and the shield not having a status element so he can proc his SP boost, it's just a bit underwhelming overall. But yeah, that's just my first impressions. I'll have a video out when we can do actual co-op IT and whatnot, and then I'll have my summons out probably tomorrow. So anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the as not gameplay. Tell me if you guys ended up summoning or are you skipping. Either or, end of month is probably going to be broken. Take care and have an absolutely amazing day.